It was one of Clara Tuckmeng Su's proudest moments, an Order of Australia medal for her work with the LGBT community. But four years later, she's handing it back. I want to send a message to the council that they need to be seen as representing the whole of the Australian community. The Canberra GP was recognised for her work with gender diverse communities and those living with HIV. She was also one of the first Australian GPs to undergo a gender transition. So I know, you know from my personal experience what it's like to actually encounter prejudice and discrimination and uh, feel the hurt and trauma from that. Dr Sue believes the decision to promote Mrs Court from an officer of the order to a companion is indefensible and has told the Governor-General she no longer feels she can accept her own award. Messages like the sort that Mrs Margaret Court that have been making that are derogatory to sub-segments in the community not, uh, are not only hurtful and destructive towards people in that community but also affect the cohesion of our society. The tennis champion has been criticised for her comments on same-sex couples and transgender people. The 78-year-old Pentecostal minister this week said it was time for her detractors to move on. I teach the Bible, uh, what God says in the Bible, and I think that is my right and my privilege. But equality groups have returned serve. This is uh, someone who at one point in time was a good sports person, but from that point has really tarnished her legacy by dividing Australia. They're concerned the decision to promote Miss Court is out of step with modern Australia. Along with a lot of Australians who have received uh, awards like mine and like Carla's, we're really considering whether our values now align with the Council's values. Another cloud over a day already shrouded in controversy. Selby Stewart, ABC News, Canberra.